this is Terry and Sarah, and you will be watching our information video on the basics of using a copier. Okay, first what you'll need to do is turn the copier on. So most copiers have the power button up top. You'll just hit that. Sometimes it may take a few minutes to turn on. And then in some offices, or in this example at the college, you'll have to have a department ID or a password to get into the copier. So I'm just going to put in our ID. And there you go. Now you're ready to start using the copier. Next we're going to show you how to load the paper. This is for regular letter size paper. And this is tray one. This is tray two of the letter size paper. Tray three is legal paper. And tray four is 11 by 17. And that's how you load the paper. Next we're going to show you some of the functions that you have on the copier. First, you have how many copies you have, and all you have to do is you can just select those from the keypad. Say I want four. You can also adjust the contrast if you want it lighter, you just hit it to make it lighter. Or if you want it darker, just make it darker. There's also some special features on some copiers where you can have a two-sided copy where you can select to go from one-sided to two-sided, or if you already have a double-sided, you can just select two-sided. There's also finishing options. And on there you can collate, and you can also do things like staple. And that are just, those are just some of the options on the copier. Next, we will show you how to make a copy. You can make a copy from the top. You press the amount you want on the keypad and you press start. And there is your copy. Another way to make a copy is on the glass. Put it face down, top up, up here in the corner where the red arrow is. Close it and press start. Next, we are going to show you how to make a copy if you have two sheets of paper and put it on a two-sided one sheet of paper. You're going to hit two-sided And then there's the two-sided right there that's already select, selected. And there is your two-sided sheet. Next, we are going to show you how to make a copy of a two-sided paper. I'm going to push two-sided, two to two, then start. Now we're going to show you how to collate. Say you have a two-page document and you need to make two copies, but you want the first and second pages to be together on both copies. 
All you do is stick the paper into the top feeder. You're going to press finishing. And then you're going to want to collate it in page order. If you didn't want that and you wanted to group all of page one and all of page two together, then you would do group same pages. But in this instance, we want to collate and put it in page order. Then you're just going to hit how many or hit OK. And then how many copies you want. I want two. And then you just hit start. Now when it's finished, you have two sets of copies, the first and second page, and then also again, the first and second page. Now we're going to staple our paper. If we have that two page paper, all you're going to do is hit finishing again. And now you'll select the staple option. You'll hit next. Now here you can either choose top left, top right, bottom right, or bottom left. We're just going to do like you usually do, is top left. You'll hit OK. Then you'll select how many copies you want. And then you hit start. Now you have your copy with the staple. Next, we are going to show you where the toner is located, just in case it needs to be changed. Just open that up, and there is the toner. Take it out, exchange it, pop that up, and close it. This concludes our informational video on how to use a copier. Thank you so much for watching today.